Everybody in Mind Wellness Center was established out of a lifelong dream to reimagine the mind-body connection. Here we explore the mind, body and spirit by merging cutting-edge innovative technology with alternative holistic wellness practices. We love what we do. We love helping you to reimagine your mind-body connection, to explore new ways of meditating, creating deeper connection with yourself, opening your heart to who you are and who you're capable of being. Please come and explore the art of your being with everybody in Mind Wellness Center. Thank you. <laughs> so I'm here to the Everybody in Mind Wellness Center in Sudbury. I'm here with Emmy, who's going to play the uh, the crystal healing bowls. Did I, did I say that right? Crystal singing bowls. Crystal singing bowls. And we can add healing in there too, apparently. So this is a great opportunity for us to use the uh, MKE 600, which I'm going to mount just above uh, Emmy up there on the uh, boom. Uh, and I'll be monitoring everything with the HD25 headphones. So just tell us a little bit about what these uh, healing bowls do for us, Emmy. Sure. So each of these bowls resonates with a certain note. So this is C, this is D, E, F, G, A, B. Um, and each of those notes aligns with a certain energy body, like an energetic system in your chakras. And so if you align with energy principles, the bowls can release and open and heal in those spaces. And if that doesn't make sense to you, even just being present with the bowls can be incredibly relieving and relaxing. And even just when our nervous system comes into a space of relaxation, we experience really deep healing and release. Sounds awesome. So uh, I can't wait to hear them. Are you ready to go? Yeah. Let's do it. So if you think about each bowl as representing an energetic part of our whole system, we start first with our root chakra, which resonates with the note C. And it's right at the tip of our tailbone. Our root chakra is where we find our belongingness in our body, our safety in this world. This is where we root, root down into the earth. And from there, we move up into our sacral chakra, which is about two inches below our belly button. And it resonates with the note D, and this is a D that I'm playing right now. Their sacral chakra is the seat of our desire. It's also the space where we find intimate partnerships and creative expression. And then we lean into our solar plexus chakra, which is just a few inches above our belly button. And it resonates with the note E, the musical note E. This is the seat of our willpower, our seed of choice. It's also known as light of a thousand suns. And this is the space where we learn how to consent and how to choose. Moving up from our sacral chakra into our heart. Resonating with the note F, which makes a perfect fourth with our root chakra. This is our heart chakra it's also physically located in our heart it's a space of unconditional love this is where we learn to express ourselves as love to give and to receive love and then moving up to the throat chakra it's our fifth chakra it's the letter the note, the musical note G. And our throat, this is where we learn to speak divine truth or speak our truth. This is also where we learn how to receive truth. It's where we express. And then moving up to A which is our third eye. It's also our pineal gland. Our third eye is physically located in the center of our brain. 
A lot of people don't know that our pineal gland actually has rods and cones, just like our eyeballs have rods and cones for receiving light and color. However, our third eye doesn't have access to physical light. But this is a space where we learn to see in the dark. This is our intuition. This is our psychic ability. This is, learn where, this is where we learn to see that everything is love and loving. And then we come up to our crown chakra. This is the letter B, the musical note B. Our crown chakra is just right at the top of our head. It's always open. It's always receiving energy from the universe. It's just whether or not we can connect with it. And so from this space, we allow the music, the sounds, the vibrations, even if it's just the relaxation, coming into a space of relaxation is very healing for our bodies. So we calm down from our heads to our sight. into our throats into our heart into our bellies our gut desire, our attraction, and fully present into our bodies, into the earth. And just allowing the energy to flow all the way through us and into the earth. Grounding. Being here in this moment. I can honestly say that I love the HD25 headphones. Uh, they feel good, they feel nice and robust, they sit very comfortably on your head. Uh, they don't move around, you, you can kind of um, give these things a lot of uh, action and uh, they stay put, they're robust, they sound awesome as well. Obviously it's very difficult to give you an audio test with these things, but just take my word for it, they're a really fabulous set of headphones. Uh, they're my go-to, I use them every day for my shoots, I use them for editing, and again I want to say thanks for joining me. My name's Stuart Beebe at Beebe Studios, thanks again, take care and I'll see you next time.